Hello viewers, a wonderful afternoon and welcome to Africa and Beyond Television Network. We'll continue to take a look on what is happening in the nation Zimbabwe without fear, without favor. What is the plan B for Emerson Dambuzum Nangago? Now that it has been proven to be very, very dangerous, difficult and untenable to uh, have 2030 agenda continue as it was, the plan B for Emerson Mnangagwa is simple. He is going to appoint one of his sons. We talked about this yesterday. And that is the only option which is quite safe for him uh, to, 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 to pursue. But also, which is going to bring some questions, or which is going to, 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 to uh, bring some unanswered questions which will remain without answers for a very long time. If you look at, at, at ZANU-PF, in terms of um, how people can be uh, uh, elected leaders, the constitution of ZANU-PF, which is right there on the screen, it speaks about rights of members, which means when you go to a branch and join ZANU-PF, you pay a joining fee, you become a member, you are given a membership card, then you have the right to participate in party elections in accordance with the such rules and regulations as the central committee shall determine from time to time. Secondly, you have the right to be elected to any office in the party. This is where everything is very, 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 very important. As an ambassador to join as NPF Nasi, you can be elected to any office of the party as long as the rules and regulations um, subjected by the Central Committee apply. So if the Central Committee meets and decide that anybody who has been or who has been a member of ZANPF for the past five years can contest in the elections, you will see the sons and daughters of Emerson Mnangagwa being able to be part of those elections. Which means Vice President Chiwenga, if we are to go to 2027, Aka gara apa, Chiwenga, O gara apa Collins Mnangagwa. And they are to be elected, both of them. Mnangagwa will be the president by that time. Which means he will be in direct control of events. He will be in direct control of the political bureau. He will be in direct control of the central committee. His people are leading the Central Committee, are very influential in the Central Committee, which means they will simply appoint Wavano Dout Iwe and you will compete with other candidates. So, for, 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 for the sake of equity Pasaita Miri Jongana Mere Mere, they will not only appoint uh, uh, Emerson Mnangagwa San, they will appoint Mnangagwa San and they will appoint another. And that the other one will be heavily subjected to, to persecution. That will be a choreographed uh, persecution. Saga, which has one out, Pazunondo Perazese, what will be the end goal? The son will be made the leader of ZANU PF. Yes, because who is going to determine the people who to attend the Congress? It's Emerson Mnangagwa. The same way that they determined the delegates who attended this conference is the same way they are going to, 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 to use. So you'd see that uh, this is something very important. This is something which is very, very, very important. And um, that is the, 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 the plan B for Emerson Mnangagwa. What is the plan C? The plan C will be to, 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 to uh, run as president in violation of the total constitution. Kana zatora mbisisa, wano tongo zi declare out in that over. And that is going then. Ine ngeava ekuti tota, ipapo pa chato vondo kera ipapo, kana tajikiwa, tajikiwa, kana ta wina, ta wina. That will be the case. So it's very important to note that, um, this is where ZANPF is going. 
they've um they seem to have begged down on the 2030 agenda although it has been adopted they seem to be backing down on the direct uh, provocations but it seems as if Mnangagwa's son will replace his father which means general ah zvinenge zvaramba zvinenge zvaramba so pachatozoita zvekuti kunenge kwa simu kamumwe anenge azosimuka from other quarters but let us understand this at a certain point in time there will be a conversation ichango zoudzwa general kuti general you are the vice president of the party vice president of the country equally you were as powerful as me we saved it together for two terms why can't we let the younger generation take over and build this country amusku zvonoti saneta ari nai general it will be very very difficult for general to say ina ndisati ndaneta it will be very difficult for him to say so so you know it depends how are they going to act how are they going to um move on from now but we cannot rule out the 2030 agenda completely because it has been adopted as a resolution and what it means is this is a matter which is now proceeding to parliament so the zanpf parliamentary caucus is going to spearhead this matter push it into parliament a motion shall be moved in parliament and you will see this matter escalating further and it will be an, an issue of subject to debate um but so it doesn't mean that breaking down they are stopping altogether they will continue the plans but using some cautious uh, uh, means so at this point in time munangagwa would then be pointing fingers at others and we also be using the constitution of zanpf against anyone else saka masoja ari kuma barracks vachangodzi vata vakomana you you can leave the barracks and come and join politics itodi to tongo tamshandira pamwe than to do whatever you are doing let it are gai vana vaite zvinhu zvanoona zvinoita that would be the justification and if zanu pf uh, um if if the generals are to use um the constitution then there is nothing they are going to do if and everything is happening from the point of view from the parliamentary point of view so we wait, watch and see what is going to happen but remember there is a story which we we we, we will cover of vice president chiwenga vachiramba zvinhu zvavaiziva kuti zviri kuiti that is going to show you the behavior the culture uh, of zanpf people thank you very much everyone